Hey guys, just wanted to show you a couple pieces that I got today as a gift. My dad and his girlfriend uh, showed up and they each had uh, an item here. They went to an antique store. Um, Cape Vincent, New York is where they were. These are the 12 inch um, HK Porter ink. <clears throat> so the HK Porter 12 inch bolt cutters. See the, the little, little nicking going on there in the cutting surfaces, but I, I think I can fix that. What's cool about these is the, the logo there on the handles. So these are, these are cool. I don't, I don't think they paid much for them, which is good, but, um, this is my first set like this. I, I've yet to come across a, a ser, uh, pair of these. I want to say that Scout Crafter did a video on these, if I'm not mistaken. Um, uh, John, comment if you did. I'm pretty sure you did, but I'm not sure if they're the same size as this or not. But I'm going to obviously uh, take these apart, clean them up. And the other item was, uh, this is an old uh, oil can. One gallon liquid, U.S. legal. DA approved, G13. Whatever that means, so... It's an old, uh, old can. Um, so it needs metal work. There's some serious denting going on up on the top part there, but I'll take care of that. So I'm going to clean this up, get rid of all the rust, and uh, do some metal work and probably paint it. I got a lot of green paint <clears throat> up in the paint stash there, a lot of John Deere green and Krylon greens that I'm itching to use. So I'll probably do green and I'll do the... Lettering, I'm thinking white. So, just wanted to show you those two items real quick. I got to get back on this fan. It's giving me trouble here. Um, so, it's a three-speed fan. Uh, three fans coming from the motor windings. Three wires coming from the motor windings down to this little switch down here. And uh, everything is working. But uh, I know these aren't known to be pretty accurate as far as their speeds, but on the high setting, it's low. On the medium setting, it's the fastest. And on the low setting, it's a little bit faster than about in between, in the middle. So I've flip-flopped everything, and you know this is exactly the way it was when I got it, so I don't know... What's what's going on here? I tried switching around these three wires here. That didn't do anything. Um, if anyone has any suggestions, uh, definitely let me know. I, I will not give up. Um, disregard the coloring on the these wires. They're um, identified as A, B, and C, not hot, common, and, and ground. Um, I just wanted to use a normal wire for the head wiring. Uh, this wire here is the actual power So I got a lot of time and I'm trying to get out of the way of the shadow I got a lot of time into this thing here and I, uh, It's driving me nuts, you know, I took pictures For reference beforehand and you know everything is exactly the way it was uh, The only difference is the wiring is new so And the way that I have it is head wire A is on this first nut, head wire B is on that third nut, and head wire C is tied in with the hot wire. And like I said, it turns on and runs and at every speed and oscillates. It's just uh, the speeds aren't right, and I, I don't know. But otherwise, the fan's beautiful. It's done other than this, and I, you know, I've taken this thing apart probably thirty times or more. So any, you know, online is very vague. There's not a lot of help as far as uh, I'm not too good with motors. You know, I can take one apart and clean it up and stuff like that. But uh, 
I don't have a ton of experience working on these little motors, but uh, you know, you, trial and error. So any help would be appreciated. And uh, as always, thanks for watching and have a great night.